This is one of the most beautiful royal couples in the world. They look as luxurious as Prince William and Kate Middleton, but they live in the Middle East. Crown Prince Hussein of Jordan recently got engaged to his beloved woman, Rajwa Al Saif. One day she will become Queen of Jordan and replace Rania Al Abdullah. But who is she? What family is she from? And will she be able to cope with the royal duties and surpass Rania? Keep watching to find out. This is WOW Channel. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for notifications. Let's begin! Queen Rania and King Abdullah II are modern royal family. They have been living together happily for almost 30 years and have raised four children. One day, the eldest of them, Crown Prince Hussein, will succeed his father and also become king. Abdullah II shows, by the example of his family, that a woman plays an important role in the social life of the country. His wife, Queen Rania, has become known for her advocacy work related to education, health, community empowerment, youth, cross-cultural dialogue. Forbes magazine has ranked Rania as one of the world's 100 most powerful women. Not surprisingly, the king's eldest son would follow the example of his father. The wife of the future king will have to perform many difficult duties. Being the consort of a monarch is not only a luxurious life in the palace and travel around the world, it is also hard work. She will have to lead charitable foundations and listen to the problems of ordinary people. Queen Rania has always done her job well. She has founded a variety of charities to campaign for various sectors of society in Jordan and beyond. Rania is also a global voice for access to quality education for children around the world. She advocates for the rights, needs and aspirations of refugees and the world's most vulnerable populations. She grew up in an ordinary Palestinian family and never dreamed of becoming a queen. The main thing that the girl wanted was to get a good education and make a career. She is a real self-made woman because her parents were not rich, not influential and didn't have a noble birth. That's why Rani understands the problems of common people very well. The citizens of Jordan love her and admire her beauty, intelligence and kindness. It won't be easy to find a second queen like her. Nevertheless, Rania approved the choice of her eldest son and even called his bride to be her third daughter, the proud mother shared. I didn't think it was possible to hold so much joy in my heart. Congratulations to my eldest Prince Hussein and his beautiful bride-to-be, Rajwa. In an additional post, she said, excited to welcome my third daughter, Al Hussein's bride-to-be, Rajwa, to the family. We are so happy for you both. On the one hand, Rajwa Al Saif is perfect for the role of queen. She is very beautiful, tall and in good shape. The future queen looks almost like a model. During the engagement, many people compared her to Kate Middleton because she was also in a blue dress. She looked sophisticated and stylish. Crown Prince Hussein fell in love with her, perhaps because she is somewhat similar to his mother. But on the other hand, Rajba grew up in completely different conditions. She is the daughter of a billionaire from Saudi Arabia, and she never knew what it was like to achieve success on her own. From birth, she had everything one could dream of. She is the youngest daughter of Khaled bin Musayed al Saif and his wife, Azza bint Naif al Sudairi. Her father is the head of the Al Saif Group, a privately owned company with a diverse portfolio of business across healthcare, construction and security services and in a board member of the Saudi-British Joint Business Council, which promotes trade between the two countries. Her family are not of royal birth, but nevertheless her father is a very influential person. 
the Alsay family's heritage dates back to the Subai tribe in the town of Alatar in Saudi Arabia, where ancestors are known to have been the sheikhs of the town. Raja's father, who resides in Riyadh, has established himself as a well-reputed businessman over the years. Rajwal Saif was born in Riyadh in 1994. She is currently 28 years old. She is the youngest of four children in the family. Rajwa raised in Saudi Arabia, where she completed her secondary education. This is a very conservative country, where women are limited in many rights. But Al Saif family apparently belongs to the progressive part of the population. They gave their daughter a good education and sent her to study abroad. The girl received a degree from Syracuse University in New York and studied at the Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising in Los Angeles after completing her secondary education in Saudi Arabia. She has worked at an architecture firm in Los Angeles and currently works at Design Lab Experience Design Studio in Riyadh. But in the future, when she becomes the Queen of Jordan, she will most likely have to leave her job, because the royal duties will require a lot of involvement. In addition, she will have to raise royal ears. It will probably be difficult for her to cope with royal duties and replace Queen Rania, because she never knew what difficulties ordinary people face. All her life she lived in luxury and could get whatever she wanted. Nobody knows what will happen in the future, but the main thing is that now the future king and queen look very happy. There is no doubt that this is a marriage of love, not of convenience. All members of the Jordanian royal family accepted Hussein's bride-to-be. King Abdullah II gave his future daughter-in-law a warm embrace at the engagement ceremony. The family posed with white smiles in several portrait shots, as the royal couple stood with their future daughter-in-law after the ceremony. This is the second engagement in Jordanian royal family this year. Just five weeks before this, Princess Iman, the oldest daughter of King Abdullah II, became engaged to New York financier Jamil Alexander Thermiotis. Her fiancé is a successful man, but he also doesn't have a royal background, just like Rajva. The Jordanian royal family is moving away from tradition. All family members are married for love, because only this is the most important thing for happiness. Do you think Rajva Saif will ever be as popular as Queen Rania? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share your thoughts with me, to click like and to subscribe. See you next time.